Lord Laidlaw came up with a concept to design a 31-foot rocket ship for Cape Town. Uh, he commissioned Mark Mills to design the boat, and this is what we've got. We've got the no-holds-barred Cape 31. Having people on a boat working as a team, that is such an inspirational thing to be involved in. You get younger people coming together. We've got crews here that are friends that have raced together. You've got families that race. So I think all in all, you, you look at this, um, the way the Cape Fleet is evolving, it's got so much going for it, so much potential. And these boats are exactly right for racing in the Solent. Uh, we've had a good weekend racing. We had a real good day yesterday with a 1 2 2, so we were leading. Uh, a little trickier today, but ended in another fun match race with Squirt like a few weekends ago. This time they came out on top, so well done to them. There's not a single person that owns one of these boats that isn't saying, I love it. Sunday racing was probably some of the most exciting you could get out on a race course on a yacht. Um, everybody was having an incredible time on Sunday. The boats were going like bats out of hell. Oh, the Cape Socials. <laughs> well, yeah, they do those Cape Socials well. Yeah, there's there's always bands, there's always music, and uh, yeah, a really friendly crowd as well. I really like the the group of people that are all coming together. I mean, a lot of us don't know each other yet, but yeah, the, it's usually the the longest nights of the Cape Socials and and the loudest ones too. Uh, it's it's um, really really pleasing actually. Last year, fewer boats bit less competition this year, a lot more competition, I felt. And um, we, I thought we sailed very, very well and was really quite surprised that we, we won. I was deli absolutely delighted. Obviously the fleet's doing, doing really well and it's healthy and, you know, great to get out in a boat this size and race around with just under 20 boats. Well, certainly in the Capes, uh, with, I mean, today was fantastic. It was because the conditions were brilliant. Great racing, lots of place changing. Well, it's, it's indescribable. We have so much fun. It's like, like uh, everything is new for us, but it's, it's a great class and it's a superb boat. You, you can really do a lot with it.
Yeah, today's racing was um, pretty full on, actually. Uh, it was wild. Um, it was really good racing, though. It was windy, it was wavy. Um, there was lots of uh, anarchy on the race course with boat handling, but we had a nice day and a clean day. So yeah, we're very happy. It's tricky, or it certainly was yesterday, but it's uh, you know it's no different to any other fleet. You've you know 20 boats, and they're all going pretty much the same speed. Uh, so all the basics, you've got to have a good start, get yourself out, uh, and give yourself a chance of being able to execute your strategy. Cape Ferry One class, without doubt, is the best class I've ever sailed in, and I've sailed in quite a few. Um, but the, the camaraderie um, and everybody is just like a team together, where everyone wants the good of the class. It's friendly, it's competitive, and it, we just really, really just enjoy racing hard against each other, but also just taking things to the next level. The class is just accelerating and getting better and better. And uh, I think as we move on into the future, it's gonna be outstanding.